giant cell arteritis is a disease that uh, has had huge unmet need ever since cortisone was invented in 67 years ago. And patients, the only medication that we had to treat patients with giant cell arteritis are glucocorticoids, prednisone. Prednisone is associated with a host of terrible side effects, although it's an effective medication in, in treating the disease. And these side effects make it very difficult to maintain patients on prednisone for a long period of time. So the goal of GIACTA was to demonstrate that tocilizumab has a powerful steroid sparing effect in the disease. Um, in order to test that hypothesis, we performed a trial that had four arms. Um, there were 251 total patients. One arm received tocilizumab, one, uh, one dose every week. Um, and there were 100 patients in that arm. The second arm received tocilizumab uh, every other week, and there were 50 patients in that arm. And then there were two prednisone-only groups. Um, one uh, group received prednisone for six months, and the other group received prednisone for a whole year. I should add that both of the tocilizumab groups also received prednisone for four to six months. And the primary outcome of the study was sustained remission at one year without any steroid therapy. Yes. So the issue is that the disease is very serious. And there is a major uh, fear that all physicians have and all patients have, and that is vision loss. The disease tends to affect the blood vessels to the head and neck, particularly those that go to the back of the eye. And that can lead to abrupt, permanent vision loss in one, if not both, eyes.